uh, I think we all together can can only win win a, a prize. Santiago, congratulations on uh, the team victory and on your stunning goal, right? Sorry? On your stunning goal. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. It was a difficult goal, but uh, thanks God that it was in. Did it help that uh, Marcos Pedersen made the overlap, creating also some space for, for you? Yeah, of course, of course. Uh, that's what we want, uh, to have a lot of players in that zone. And and yes, the defender goes with Marcus, and then I, I got it to my left. And thanks God, like I say, that is in. A goal is a goal, but was this the most beautiful one you scored for Feyenoord thus far? Uh, yeah, I think uh, like a goal, I think this is the best. But like in the moment, I like the, the Lazio goal. <laughs> yeah, that's also because of the importance, yeah. I think. Yeah, of course. The moment, I mean, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, what do you think about the overall game today and the fact that it was exciting until the last second? Yeah, um, it was a really good goal uh, of Herrenbein. And, and we, I only need to say that I'm, I'm really proud of my team because they fight till the end. Uh, the players that come in, they fight a lot. Uh, we we play uh, 120 minutes uh, Wednesday and now the the ones that play 90 minutes they look like uh, they only play five minutes you know and that's the physical of this this team the heart and I, I love that. Does it feel unnecessary that that it was so tight until the last second? No, no, because they are a great team. Uh, we knew it uh, at the beginning that this will be a very hard game. Uh, we scored two goals, but uh, we start playing good, I think, when they score. Uh, it was upside, but then we start to play good. And we knew it. It was it's going to be a very hard game. And like I said, I, I'm prob I, I, I am proud of my team because we, we fight till the end. How has it been for you, your, your time at Feyenoord so far? Of course, you are now the number one striker. Your trainer also said some things about that. How has it been being on the bench and have to come in as a substitute and now be the first striker? I don't know if I'm the, fir the first striker, but I, I always say it. Uh, we, the 23 players, 24, uh, I think we all together can, can only win, win a, a prize. Fire in the hole. <laughs> Keep Again, the okay. question? <laughs> yeah. Let's see if I remember after the Fuego. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, how, how has it been for you from being a substitute to, to having a starting position and what, what's the, the main difference for you? Uh, yes, I was saying that we are fair, you know, we have 25 players that we know that the one that is going to play, he's going to do the best. Uh, I'm not the first striker, uh, Danny and me, we are the first striker, both, because I think it, it's it's about of tactics, no? Uh, some games he's, he's starting and, and then I I enter a few minutes, uh, now I it's my turn to start, Danny enter in a few minutes. But we both uh, give, all, give all for the team and I, I think the, it's, it's about tactics, it's just that. One last thing, we're doing this in English now. I remember your presentation not so long ago, it was in Spanish. Did yeah. you learn all this in just a few months? Or? Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah? Uh, That's yeah. impressive, man. Yeah, I think <laughs> I improve a lot of English, but I still need to improve more. Um, I think it's just confidence and, and to try it because I can make a mistake now, but this is the life, you know? <laughs> yeah. Good luck. Thanks. Thank you very much.